And this is Jenny, our yard apprentice. And what she's doing at the moment, she's riding this horse. She's going to tack it up. So what she will do is she will put the bridle on first. She will put the head collar on and tie the horse up. Then she will take the rugs off. She will take the horse's temperature. If the horse's temperature is okay, she'll carry on doing her job. If the horse's temperature is not right, she'll probably stop and we'll go and ride something else because obviously the horse isn't quite right. She will then pick the horse's feet out to make sure that he's got all his, or she's got all her shoes and she's got everything necessary to go and do her exercise. And then she'll put the saddle on and then, all right, struggling. <laughs> And then she will take the horse out into the ring, which we will see when they all walk around. And then they have a warm up, go and do their exercise, and then come back and have a cool down. They're like athletes; they've got to warm up, do their exercise, and then cool down. This is a lovely filly stepping out. She ran twice. She won one and finished second in another race last year. And then she had a bad accident, which meant that she broke her leg. Basically, she broke a bone in her leg. It was repairable. She's got screws and plates in it. Um, she's a very nice filly, she's probably one of the nicest fillies we're going to see racing this year. She looks to have recovered from her injury, so she's, uh, she's one to watch out for on the telly. I think she could be quite good. <laughs> okay, if we walk over towards the gallop, the horses will be starting to go around the country quite a lot now. So these are coming up now, they've just done a gentle seven furlong canter, it's an easy day. I will get them as they come by. This is a five year old mare called Shawari, she's a sprinter as well. And that's Lady Red Oak, that's the filly that I said is really funny, she has to exercise just with one horse. She doesn't like me now. The horse in front is the horse that's going to be connected called Bob Masnicking. So he, the person who wants to buy him wants to race him in Belgium. So he will come by us now. He will start quicken up. He's a little bit of a monkey, so Sonia will let him go a little bit. He'll start to hit about 40 mile an hour for about a four lunch. Up his lungs. So then we've got Wall of Sound. We've got a lovely little coach to worry. There he goes to the tomorrow. That's what we see. That's at the back. And they will just keep walking and then they lose their feet. Like I'm sure we've all done, put a puppy over a bath, it will start to pedal before it actually hits the water. So this is a little two-year-old colt who's had an injury and he needs more exercise. So he will swim morning and night, he will catch in the morning because he lost the period. He just come back a little bit because he's done. It's about three meters. It's room temperature, the room temperature is one over, we'll carry a film of bacteria and bugs. Very not good for racehorses as the rest of the system is very, very sensitive because they inhale hundreds of gallons every time they breathe. 